So I'm gonna go over a hopscotch activity that you can do at home. What you're gonna need is construction paper, um, any paper you have at home. You can use if you have little markers that you could place on the floor. We just don't want anybody to slip or fall during this activity. So we wanna keep it safe. So preferably on a carpet where there's not a lot of furniture around. And if it's easier for them most of them might want to wear sneakers, but they're not going to get the same input if they wear sneakers. So barefoot would also work. It's probably the best option. So I'm going to show you how I set it up, and then we'll do it together. Okay, so I'm going to show you how I set it up, just so you can set it up, and then we'll do it together. So what I did is I put a laundry basket here at the end, and then I put markers on the floor. I also put some um, toys, anything they have. I used some, like two of the balls I had in my house at the beginning because we're going to use those as well. Okay. So as you can see, you have the markers on the floor and then the laundry basket at the end, kind of a few feet away. So what you want to do is you want to have them pick up either one of the balls, hold it in their hand, start on the first marker with feet together, and then you're going to give them the cue to open, and then to the next marker, close, open, close, and have them toss the ball into a laundry basket, bucket, anything you have at home. Then you're going to have them Go back, same thing, feet together, open, 